Oh my god. Um. Oh my god. This video is called, uh, I told you so. I told you so. I told you so. I told you so a million times. Um. There's like a million people sent me a link to the Aussie guy down under. The guy hates me, and I don't give a damn about that. Um, the Aussie photographer. Um, anyway, like a million people linked me to his recent video, and I watched the whole thing. And, uh, no, I'm not attacking the guy. The video was accurate. And I'm like, well, duh. Not meaning him, but this is what I've been saying. Everything that he complained about that uh, Sony did to him, which was accurate, it, it, he's 100% believable and he's 100% accurate in that video of why he's dropping the Sony, is the same damn thing I've been telling every one of you. Sony doesn't repair their own cameras. Sony tech support and customer service sucks. Sony has always been that way. I mean, their way, you know, when they're making cassette recorders and all sorts of uh, professional audio gear back in the day, they outsource their... Once the, here's how Sony works, okay? And this is basically, in essence, what the guy down under said. And I've been saying this for years. Okay, and you're like, oh, you just hate Sony. It's like, no, they suck. Once they sell a product, like, here's your Sony, then whoosh, whoosh, they wash their hands of you. Okay? It's like, you got a part issue, you got a repair issue, you got a warrant. You know, forget about it. Sony don't repair their own cameras. Fuji Tech Support? It's incredible. It's incredible. They will bend over backwards and kiss your fanny for tech support. You know, not just Fuji, Nikon, Canon. So anyway, I was watching his video. I even watched a portion of it twice and it's like, you know, I kept going to myself, you know, I know he doesn't watch my videos, I don't give a damn, but, you know, I've worked in some camera stores, okay? I know how these people work. I know what Sony does. Everything this guy said that the Aussie shooter from Down Under was accurate. You know? The video was accurate. And so many people like, oh my god, he's dropping the Sony. It's like, this is it. I've made so many videos. I mean, a lot of videos. Saying the exact same damn thing. Oh, but no, you all attack me for it. Oh, no. Well, this, well, this video is called, duh. I told you so. It is, everything you said is exactly what I told you. Poor customer service. She has to keep calling. Did you get my camera? Did you get my camera? Um, they sent it back and they didn't clean the sensor. Well, you know, there's oversights. You know, and now he mentioned that they have like a professional program, but you got to pay a bunch of money for it and you got to have a certain amount of gear and then you got to pay a stupid fee on top of that and some other nonsense. And he kept talking about, uh, he found out that that was typical return time was a, a little over a month, I think he said. And he kept saying, he kept getting... Uh, you know, non-photography people that were incredibly rude on the phone. And, uh, you know. Here's something else he didn't mention that I will mention to you. Okay, you better damn well pay attention to what I'm about to say. Okay, because it's important. If Sony treats a guy like that, you know, that is like yakking about Fuji, you know, I mean, excuse me, Sony, about how great Sony is shooting with the Sony, you know, there's like, you know, there's like a dozen people on YouTube out there that are like, you know, that guy is, uh, I'm not saying he's a sponsor from Sony, he's not, not that I know of. He is giving Sony a lot of advertising. Pay attention. <sighs> if they are treating that guy that bad, how the hell do you think they'll treat you? You know? It's like, this guy is giving Sony a lot of free advertising, and, uh, you know, he's probably selling a lot of their product for them. For free, no less. You know? You know, he likes the product, that's fine, I don't care. You like the Sony, fine. <sighs> if they treat him that way, how the hell do you think they'll treat you? Mm -hmm. ah. You think about that one? <sighs> Here's something, everything he said is what I've been preaching for ages about Sony. They don't repair their own crap, they don't give a damn about you. Once they sold you their product, they're done with you. You know, he gave... You know, we don't repair our own products. You contact these people over in the Philippines and, uh, you know, talk to them. That's exactly how they treat you. Wow. Another thing. He didn't mention it in the video, but this is why. Why are you like it, Sony? I got a Sony camera and it's awesome. I just love it. Okay, fine. You love the camera? 
The, the part that you don't see, like about this Fuji, is the same thing you don't see about the Sony or anybody else. It's the stuff that surrounds it. It's called the ecosystem. It's this invisible bubble. And this invisible bubble is comprised of tech support, customer service, parts replacement, cheap parts, availability, third party cheap parts, customer service, tech support. It's this invisible bubble that surrounds this camera. Well, I can't see it. You know, I like the camera a lot. Yeah, what about when you have an issue and you have to call somebody for TOUCH YOUR THROAT! But I've been... Everything he complained about in this video is what I've been slapping like a Bible, like a, like a crazy preacher slapping the Bible up in the pulpit. What's my blood pressure? Let me check my blood pressure now. <laughs> <laughs> his video is accurate. I don't fault him for his video. He's accurate in everything he said. He's accurate in why he's upset. He's accurate all down the road. <laughs> and all those, all you people, which, you know, is fine. I mean, man, a bunch of you sent me a link to that guy's video. like, I'll watch it. His video, the video is accurate. There's nothing to fault him on. It's accurate. He's right. He's right to be upset. He's right and accurate in everything he said. So I'm praising his video. But it's also the same thing I've been telling you all for some time now. A long time. There's a big bubble around your camera. I know what that bubble is. I'm like the ghost whisperer, you know? You know how she can like see stuff that other people can't see? Well, I'm the camera whisperer. I can see the bubble that surrounds the Fuji ecosystem. I can see the bubble that surrounds the Nikon, the Sony, okay? You got an issue with the Fuji? Fuji take care of it for you. Like that. You got an issue with the Sony? Like, you bought it already. You know, you contact those people in the Philippines. You know, screw you. We, you know, you bought it. Uh, you know, send it to them. You might get it back in a month or two. Yeah. The ecosystem bubble. The camera whisperer. Hey, if I buy you, you're a neat camera. What about your tech support and your customer service? Ah, oh, I got really good customer service. Ah. Oh. And if this were a Sony, it's like, oh, I kind of like you. You're a neat camera. What if I buy you, Mr. Sony? I suck. You know, if you got an issue with me, you're screwed. Uh, you get it? So I liked watching that guy's video. He hates me. I don't give a darn. You know. Um, we might be oil and water. I don't care. You know, I don't care what he thinks about me. You know, if you're a truth seeker, you don't give a damn. If someone says something accurate and intelligent, it's like, you know, I... You know, uh, we personally don't get along, but what you said was accurate, correct, truthful, honest, and I applaud you for it. But it's also what I've been telling every one of you people about Sony. Ah! Thanks for linking me that video. It was fun to watch. It was an accurate video. I agree with him. He's correct. But it's also, it's also the same thing I've been telling you all for some time. That's exactly how they treat their... Uh, and, and again, in closing, remember, if they treat him that way, him, if they, if they treat him that way, how the hell do they think they're going to treat you? You know, this guy's given them a lot of uh, airtime. A lot. He's uh, selling a lot of their cameras by proxy. In other words, he said, I love the camera. He's like, oh, he loves the camera. I'm going to go buy one, too. So you would think if Sony were smart, they would, like, uh, you know, like, uh, immediately... Like, fly this guy out overnight, a new camera. He's like, you know, oh, you got an issue? Mr. Aussie photographer, we're going to take care of you like that. Uh, but no, they, uh, they didn't treat him very well. Uh, yeah. That says a lot, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It says a lot. Yeah. Think. Uh, I like to use this thing up here. Apparently mine works. A lot of people's it doesn't work. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Bye.